the American Robin. Scientific name Turtis Margatorius is very common here in Missouri. Belonging to the genus True Thrush, the robin prefers woodland and open field habitats, sometimes even urban areas. They mainly eat fruit and insects, which like us, have turned into ATP for energy. The robin forms a commensalistic relationship with trees when they build a nest in them, since it benefits the robin and has no real effect on the tree. And being migratory birds, they are able to inadvertently plant trees as they travel for the winter. Like us, birds like the American robin also have to maintain a constant body temperature, which is why birds tend to head south for the winter. American robins have a gray back, red chest, and a dark gray head. These traits make up their DNA sequence, which are the instructions for making proteins in their body. Us humans have a habit of doing things that benefit ourselves, oblivious to how it affects the things around us. The use of an insectoid called DDT from humans had resulted in a large amount of robins dying every season. It was because the insectoid would affect the worms in that area, and since worms are a main part of the American robin's diet and a limiting factor for it, they stopped nesting in the areas where DDT was used. However, some robins were able to gain a bit of resistance to DDT if they had more fat stored in their body, since DDT would cause robins to lose fat drastically, killing them. DDT was eventually banned because of the negative effect it had on ecosystems. <laughs>